Welcome back to SMW. It's your host, GF. Week 13, Dallas Cowboys weekly wrap. And they crushed the Colts, 54-19. Again, we don't need to go into all of the uh, statistics. Uh, it's the Colts. They're a shit team. Good for Dallas, though. Held, uh, you know, kind of kept Jonathan Taylor in check. Didn't have a huge, huge game. I think he had like 80-something yards, but that's what Dallas has to focus on. Matt Ryan's old. He's not going to do it. They have bad weapons, so I knew it was going to be a bad night. Shout out to my boys, uh, DJ Pat and Kavitz. You guys are at the game. Uh, you guys are at the Mavericks game. I see OBJ's there trying to court him. And uh, you guys are at the Leaf uh, Stars game tomorrow. So enjoy. Wish I was there. You guys saw a beatdown. Zeke still has it. Pollard did his thing. Dak did his thing. Uh, that first interception, that's a star call on uh, Gilmore. That was pass interference on Michael Gallup. Michael Gallup, very happy for him, man. Good guy, the right attitude, came back from the injury, great body. He can moss guys up top and uh, two touchdowns. Again, if we get OBJ, we have a lot of weapons. James Washington uh, is going to make the season debut soon. So we might have up to five receivers, two solid tight ends, Schultz, and uh, who I think will be his replacement, uh, Ferguson. And then you have two solid running backs, which brings me back to Ezekiel Elliott. Everyone, yeah, I love Tony Pollard. But don't forget, Ezekiel Elliott is still the fucking man. Everyone in Dallas loves him. Uh, gets along with Tony Pollard. Other star running backs could have bitch, moan, complain. Zeke is all about winning. It's all about winning. Zeke did his thing. He can go to other teams in the future and still do his thing. Get 20, uh, 20 plus touches a game. I still believe in him. And a lot of uh, people on TV don't. And they were wrong and I was right, which is why you watch SFW. Because um, the few times I'm wrong, I admit it. But... The whole Ezekiel Elliott is this and that and these morons skip bail to them. It's all fake news, guys. Ezekiel Elliott still has it. But again, when you have another running back that's taking your carries and has earned the right to take those carries, hey, you got thunder and lightning and Dallas, it's all about winning. But uh, let's pump the brakes, people. This is a shit team. You had an easy schedule this year. So did the Eagles. We're going through the AFC South now. We have the Texans and the Jaguars coming up again. Good for Dallas, taking care of business, but it's all about that Christmas Eve game against the Eagles. Then you got the Titans, who are always difficult. And then you got the uh, Washington to close out the season. So this three game stretch will solidify their playoff spot, but they're still measuring stick games. And it's all going to come down to that first wild card game. So, uh, Cowboy fans, we have a lot to be excited about. But at the same time, you haven't won shit yet. So stay humble, stay hungry. Let's go get it.